Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a little cat that's a little bright. Not impressed. You want to impress.
gonna be asleep, but we're gonna be there. I know, honey. Oh, I know. You do. I know.
Well, I'll let you do. Time for the Reese's. He was pretty ferocious a minute ago. So you can see the food was not <laughs> the food was not welcomed. So try to yeah. Well who's that? Someone up there's I know buddy. Feeling a bit ferocious. Four. Okay. You're okay, buddy. Good boy. Oh. His toes are on my leg. So he's pretty ferocious. Just because he's scared. His head is right here. So the most important thing, hey meds. So I'm trying to be mindful of where his head is at all times. Because that's the most important part. Of course, I've got some awkward blanket lumps in between. I'm going to try to actually put it through this hole in the blanket. I think I can. Do you see your nose? You're okay, buddy. Oh, I can make you flip it now. There. He got it. He bit, he bit the syringe. And that gave me opportunity to get it in there. You're okay, buddy. I'm just going to cover his face a little bit better. And take a look at his leg. He's having normal feral cat reaction. Um, this is the alternative to when we get them in and they're shut down. So he's not shut down. He's fighting. 
Here's a little paw. Is that a back paw or all of the back paw? Okay, I can use that one. Still use, I still do use gloves, but I'm being as careful as I can be. Just to know where. Here, there it is. Alright, so. Try not to stick my fingers into a, a mouth. Because I have to pull his, his foot out. So he's grabbing me. I'm going to take that out too because it's dirty. Okay, buddy. I know, I'm sorry. He's holding my hand. Of course, I can't. Oh, it's okay. You're okay. The swelling is significantly reduced. I'm going to try to take a picture so I can, I'll post, if I can get a picture, I'll post it on Tiny People so you can see the difference. So it's going to be a bit tricky. I'm trying to take this right there. It's looking much better though. Great job, buddy. I'm proud of you. Oh man, it's amazing how much better it looks. I can get a better picture from this angle. You guys aren't going to believe the difference two days makes. Thank goodness. He must be feeling so much better. He's definitely putting weight on it. With, with my hand. Good job, buddy. I'm very proud of you. I would like to see. Yep, not trimming nails because he's not going to be here very long. They're quite sharp. But uh, I'm not going to torture him by forcing him to stay any longer than he needs to. So he's gotten his pain meds. That was, and his leg's looking much better. I'll post the before and after photo. Well, I already posted the before photo, but I'll post the after photo on uh, tiny tapeworms. I'm going to put this. So he has a nice, smooth, soft place. I'm hoping I can get the blanket boxed again. That would be ideal. But you can see how essential the bin is in doing all of this. Because if I didn't have the bin, it would be... I'd have to chase him and, you know, with him being fairly aggressive because he's so scared, it's not, it would be a crap shoot. Okay, buddy, where's your head? Okay, I got you. You're okay, okay? Because he's not super covered right now and he could bite through the blanket very easily. But, alright, you're okay. You're okay, I promise. I promise. I'm not going to attempt any sort of socializing with him because um, he's made his feelings pretty clear and I'm going to respect respect that because all I need to do, buddy, is get you back. You're okay. You're okay. I got gotcha. you. You're okay. Try to 
Okay then. Looks like it's sort of falling apart a bit. I'm not gonna mess with it too much right now because I think that could I have the back corner Entryway. Let's see if you can stick his head out. There's a little water spillage. So he will be able to stick his head out when he wants to. We've got clean blanket, food, and a banana, sort of. over there but I'm not going to do too much about it. Okay, I think that's about all I can do at the moment.
mission accomplished. And uh, hopefully he'll have a snack and some water and maybe he'll even come out. But he did get his pain meds, that's what's important. Um, and at least he's not, he's not um, making the decision difficult about whether he wants to stay or go back. He definitely wants to go back. So uh, this is day three. Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Or you call it day two, I guess, so Tuesday, Wednesday. So like Wednesday, maybe, if he's still doing really well um, physically, then I will probably take him back with me when I go feed. Um, I will go post that photo of his leg on Tiny Tapeworm so you can see the improvement. And what else? I think I will turn this off for the evening.